Welcome to our regular news update, where we share news and events from around the East Gippsland Shire. There's been plenty happening over the last few weeks, so let's see what's happening. Last week, our region hosted the Australian National Roadmaster Cycling Championships over four days, attracting hundreds of cyclists from across the country. The event was well regarded as a success, and there was certainly a hive of activity around the townships and race locations. They included Meetung, Twin Rivers and Painesville. The event was a major economic stimulator, and there were many positive comments from visitors riders and their families about the region. For all the winners, a big congratulations. Even a few locals made the podium. Council staff have been working behind the scenes to deliver a number of events for Seniors Month. There have been great support for the varied program, highlighted by a full house at the Bansdale Sporting and Convention Centre for the free annual concert. This year, Nicky Nichols presented You've Got a Friend with a Touch of James Taylor. It was a really class act and well appreciated by all. Learn to swim youngsters, lap swimmers and fitness fanatics jump straight back into their recreation and leisure routines following the reopening of the aquatics area at the Bansdale Aquatic and Recreation Centre on October the 15th. The anticipated six weeks closure was reduced to just three weeks through the work of council and contractor Brooker Builders. Council thanks everybody for their patience during the recent closure and throughout the construction phase. The project will be completed by Easter 2019. Meanwhile at Orbos, council staff, volunteers and businesses banded together to pump water from the Orbos outdoor pool into trucks and cart to drought affected farmers. More than 600,000 litres of water was carted over three days. The pool has since been repainted is looking good ahead of the summer swim season. Work crews continue to make great progress into this year's $41 million Capital Works program. The footpath crew have made the most of the great weather, including replacing a section of path near Eastwood Playground and also welcome works in Francis Street, Bansdale. Durban Channel Works are progressing along Forest Road or Bost. The 16th anniversary Barry Sheen Tribute Ride also attracted more than 600 riders. It's events such as these that continue to put East Gippsland on the map and work hand in glove with the Council's vision to make East Gippsland the most livable region in Australia. There's lots of ways of keeping up with what's happening around the East Gippsland Shire. You can see our local newspapers, visit our website, follow us on Facebook and Twitter and of course there's more of these news updates when you subscribe to our YouTube channel.